Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Star. Today I am doing my evening skincare routine with Korean skincare products and I'm using some of the products that I am giving away for Vlogmas. This is Vlogmas day three. I'm going to do my evening routine in the form of a vlog. So there's not going to be a ton of fancy things happening in the video, all the sequences and all of that. So I hope you all still enjoy the video. Um, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go ahead and take off my hat and um, put on my cute bunny ears. Or I think they're cat ears. I got this from a tooth house. Um, maybe I should add this to the giveaway. So the first thing I'm going to do is remove my makeup and I'm using the Hamish All Clean Balm. I've mentioned this balm previously in my current favorites uh, that I posted last month. Um, if you guys haven't seen that, I will link it up here in the eye box. Um, we're gonna just rub it in. Now, I didn't put on any foundation. I just put on a little bit of concealer underneath my eyes and I did my color correcting around my mouth area and a little bit around my nose. I do have on some waterproof mascara that I need to get off because I haven't been removing my makeup this weekend and um, it's just been stuck there all weekend and it's time to take it off. Whenever I wear makeup, I double cleanse. So I'm gonna go ahead and use this Rice Brightening Cleansing Foam from Skin Food. I feel like I look like a tiger. Rawr. Like a snow leopard. Rawr. I do wanna do a very light to tiny bit of exfoliation. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab my uh, Neogen Bio Peel Gauze Pass. They're infused in wine. Again, I'm giving these away. There are two sides to the pad. So on this side, it has, it's a little bit more abrasive. And so this is what you would rub in a circular or outward motion on your skin. And this is just to try to like, you know, soothe down that uh, little bit of abrasion. So we're going to go ahead and exfoliate really quickly and then I'm gonna go ahead and rinse this off again off camera there's a lot of water contact that's happening with the skin and while we're exfoliating I'm gonna have a cookie you guys won't judge me right I love these Beatrice Pox cookies the original Danish assortment they're so good these and um, I only eat them in the winter time because they're like appropriate winter food so this cookie Mm, so, good. so we are done with our double cleansing, our exfoliating. Now we're going to go ahead and soothe the skin a little bit more with these makeup remover pads from Simple. And make sure to see if I got any additional eyeliner or mascara on, especially in the inner and yep, I still have a little bit. But that's the stuff that I don't feel comfortable putting in the, you know, the double cleansing on. So we're done with that. We're moving on to our final steps. We are going to do a quick pimple prevention with the One Step Simple Clear Pads from Costa Rex. And they are a new cosmetic standard. They are raging and sold out all over Korea. And these were actually gifted to me. Um, from Style Korean and um, Reward Style. I'm one of their influencers, so was really lucky to get that. Um, so the toner that I'm using is my Holy Grail from Thayer's, and it is their Witch Hazel Rose Petal um, Alcohol-Free Toner. So now that we finished double cleansing, exfoliating, and toning, it's time for moisturizing. But first, before we moisturize, I like to go ahead and put on this BHA Black Powerhead um, Liquid from Course RX. Now I am obsessed with this. This really helps with preventing breakouts, helps out with blackheads. I know my skin needs it. Like when my skin starts acting up, it just acts crazy. So final steps are moisturizing. So I'm gonna go ahead and put on this sheet mask. This is a Medi Hill sheet mask. This is for ample hydropore activator. So it's a hydro peel. Um, and it's for dry, normal combination and oily skin. I will have a video about my top 10 favorite sheet masks um, or sheet masks that I think you all should try. After I'm done with my sheet mask, I'm gonna leave it on for about 15, 20 minutes. I put on my Ultimate Moisturizing Honey 
overnight mask. This is from Course RX. I've used this product one or two times. Um, it's a newer product. Again, this was gifted to me from Style Korean Course RX and a reward style. So um, I haven't decided how I like it. I usually like the rice one better, but I figured I'll give this one a try. And after I'm done applying my overnight cream, I go ahead and add in my last and final step, my Benton eye cream. This is holy grail material, guys. You need this in your life. So I'm going to list it down below. Make sure you guys pick it up because <sighs> I didn't know I needed it until I had it. And I know it seems like I'm doing a lot for my skin, but these steps and like these products have brought my skin to where it is now compared to what it looked like before I came to Korea. For this video, let me know down below if you enjoyed my Korean skincare evening routine. Let me know if you use any of these products or if you would like to try any of these products. Don't forget to go ahead and enter the Vlogmas giveaway. Again, you have to comment on every single video that is a part of this Vlogmas series to win. And I will have all of the rules for the giveaway listed in the description box. You can join in on Vlogmas at any time. I hope to see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas Day 4, which will be a actual vlog. So I hope you guys enjoy that. See you guys later in the next video. Bye.